Hey guys, and welcome to episode 15 of the Carpy FC Career Mode Series. In this episode, we'll be facing Cagliari, and also we'll be facing Chievo Verona. Well, actually, we'll simulate the match against Chievo Verona. We'll play Kiewit, and then we'll finish off the episode with a match against Napoli. So, here we are facing Cagliari at the Stadio Classico. Now, Cagliari, they just promoted, but they do still have a pretty strong team. And that includes Marco Sao, who's now in the Serie A, so he's going to cause some trouble with that. Uh, I think he has like 92, 89 pace, I'm pretty sure. No, Marco Sao. F*** off, Marco Sao. Great save, Donnarumma. I don't even know how he got to that, but he somehow did. That's a great ball down to Bergwin. Bergwin, bring it back to Dos Santos or Lasagna. That's that's all right. Uh oh, here we go. Oh, the guard. Oh, he's offside. No. What? How was that a foul? How? What? Okay, let me let me see this real quick. I got the ball on that. And then my player kind of glitched into my other player and okay well they have a penalty all right well we just have to guess where they're going yes Donnarumma that's a brilliant play you can bring it down to Lolo you can find oh damn it I thought that was gonna be an own goal maybe so at halftime it is nil nil it's a very close game it really is I mean I'd say 50-50 on the possession, really. Uh, let's go and see that real quick. And, um, about 50-50, not really. 54% of possession for Cagliari. I thought I had more possession, but it seems like I'm going more of the counter-attacking play. And as you can see, I've only had one shot, but I've definitely tried to create some chances. They just haven't really worked out. Odegaard is looking a bit tired, so we'll take him off and we'll put in, um... We'll put in Pasquiti, see how he does there. Oh no. For God's sake, man! Uh oh, here we go. Lasagna. Lasagna, come on! Ugh! Damn it! Okay, so a new formation here. I'm not sure if we can get it in time. I mean, the goal, that is. But we can we can see. Ultra attacking, guys. Come on. Come on. That's a good ball. Degal D. Yes, it's a penalty! Yet another penalty! My god, man. Okay, guys. All we have to do is score it. Mbakoku on the penalty. Can he score it? Well, we lost 1-0, and you know what? It's fine. We didn't have our best team playing at all, really. I mean, we didn't have uh, Di Gaudio playing about the entire time. And um, we also didn't have, uh, what's his name? A uh, Marty in the back, so... Yeah. Thing is, Donnarumma still got a pretty good uh, rating there, a 7.8. He had four saves, so well done, Donnarumma. Other than that, the team really didn't do too well. Uh, training sessions for Darmian and uh, Marty. I want Darmian to get to that 64, and he might get to it soon. Also, look at uh, Emba or not Emba Kogu, uh, Marty's uh, stamina there. It's 98. The next time we trade him, his stamina is going to be 99. That's insane. More training sessions for Darmian and Amarty. I think Darmian can hit that 64. He doesn't, but as you can see, Amarty has 99 stamina. And I'm not sure if this actually happens to work, but as you can see, there's a little 100 thing over at the end of Amarty's stamina meter there. Do you guys think that it's even possible for Amarty to actually get 100 stamina? It, it might actually be possible. Who knows? Who knows, actually? We have a scout report. Let's look into this. Nope. 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 Oh, wow. This guy actually looks good. I'll sign him. Costa 63 rated. 
Oh, damn. <laughs> so now we'll just simulate this match against Chi of Verona. I think we can win it. Let's see. And boom. 2-1. Digaudio and Mbakogu both scored the goals. Well done, team. Well done. Okay, more training sessions. This time it's for Darmian, Matri, and Amarty this time. And Amarty, just a little closer to that 75. And Darmian's almost to that 64. Once he's at that 64, his potential will rise quite a bit. I'll just say that now. I mean, he's 15 years old. So, now we have a match against Kewit. Uh, I'm pretty sure I'll just play... Uh, an edited squad, I guess. We'll have Embakogu on at least, and we'll have Dos Santos on as well, but we'll have a Marty on. We'll replace Lolo with Werner, and then we'll have Brandon Barker play uh, this time. And then Kamano can stay, and um, we'll give Poli a chance. So here we are at Euro Park playing Empoli. Now, it seems like we've really grown a rivalry with Empoli. We're not supposed to really have this in intended at all, but you know what? It, it's fine with me. More rivalries means more entertainment. So, yeah. We have we have actually never won against Empoli. We've drawn against them, I think, twice? Maybe once? I think only once. So, can we win against them? Maybe, guys. It's Mbakogu. Mbakogu, take a shot. Saved by Pelagati. Werner. Ooh. I thought that was going in. What a shot by Werner. Marty. Not yellow. Oh, that's Barker, actually. Mbakogu. Yes! It's already 1-0 in the 13th minute. At halftime, it's 1-0. We've had plenty of shots, but we need to find that second goal just to finish off the game and be sure that we actually win this game. That's all I gotta say. Only one substitution we're putting in the American Golden Boy for Brandon Barker. I just want to try him out again. Brandon Barker has been pretty good. He did get himself an assist, I'm pretty sure. So, uh, well done, Brandon Barker. It's, uh, it's Pulisic time. That's brilliant, Amarty. Can we get Embakogu's brace? Ugh. Oh, so close, Embakogu. Oh, snap. They just got one back. Oh, nice Pulisic. Oh. Pulisic. Pulisic! Yeah, we're definitely improving his finishing. That was f***ing terrible. Pulisic. Okay, nope, never mind. We'll just bring it to one of the Empoli players, and now they have a counterattack. this is not good. Oh, no. Donnarumma, you absolute god. We get a draw. Really should have made it 2-0. But, ugh, fucking hell, man. I, I thought we should have won this game. But, you know what? We gave up that goal, and we, we weren't very wise when deciding not to actually defend a lot more. Because we were really on a fast tempo with those attacks, and it was just not really helping us out at all. So, I mean, Empoli get the goal back, and uh, props to them. F*** you. Training sessions for Darmian, Pulisic, and Omardi. I'm... Trying to improve Pulisic's uh, finishing there. And as you can see, it just improves a little bit. He's now 70 rated as well. And also, Darmian is at a 64 rating. So, well done to Darmian. Looking at our youth academy so far. Uh, match 3, 54 rated. I think he upgraded? I think? Okay. Uh, Giulio Darmian. He's 64 rated. 15 years old. He has a potential of 78 to 84. Looks like it increased. And Raffaele Costa, 63 rated, has a potential of 77 to 94. Okay, so training sessions for our Youth Academy winger, Donnarumma and Mattiello. I want to get this winger to a 64 rating just so his potential will get a boost. 
So, uh, yeah. Well, it's good to be back home. We're facing Napoli, of course. Uh, I'm not sure if we can win this one. Or even really get a result. We just haven't really done too well. We haven't made the wisest of choices either. When we're uh, at least, like, 1-0 up. So, uh, we just gotta play smart. Just gotta play smart, alright? So, uh, let's just do this. It's a great tackle. Can he get to that? Yes, he can. Oh, snap. Oh, snap. A Marty. Yes! It's already 1-0! Tabni Dos Santos! A brilliant tackle by Gagliolo starts up that brilliant counterattack. And there we go! We're already 1-0 up against Napoli. We could actually keep our chip. Well, actually, no. I think it's the Europa League uh, spot at the moment. Because I'm pretty sure that it's only first to third that you uh, are able to, you know, get into the Champions League. It would be pretty cool to actually get into the Champions League this season, but I doubt it'll happen. Come on, O. Yes. Uh-oh. We could make this too. And Bakoku! No! No! Dos Santos shoot! Oh, it should have been 2-0. We could have finished it off right there. So at halftime, it is 1-0. Really think it should be 2-0. But Mbakogu had to miss and hit the crossbar instead. But you know what? 1-0 against Napoli. That's pretty good. Not gonna lie. <laughs> Just gotta be wise this time, and not attack so much. And we're doing that so far. Oh my god, I thought that went in. And it was very close to going in. Thank god for the post there, man. This is getting really annoying. Like, seriously. Fuck off, man. What? Oh, piss off, man! It should have been 1-0. Really should have been 1-0. Ugh, oh, for God's sake, man! Another draw! Another fucking late equalizer! I'm just done, man. Fucking done! We should have won. I really think we should have won. Oh, for God's sake, man. Napoli were just... They were all over us in the last, like, ten minutes, so... Props to them. Ugh, oh, God damn it, man. Matter of the match, I believe, was a Marty. Yeah, definitely a Marty. He had an assist and 13 out of 14 passes. And I'm pretty sure, if I can go to performance, um, let's see his interceptions real quick. He had one interception. Thought he had more, but I guess not. So, I guess uh, in the next episode, you'll be seeing me face Torino. I'll simulate the match against Perugia or Perugia. It's probably Perugia. And then we'll end the episode with a match against Fiorentina. And then after that, you guys can suggest me players I can buy in the January transfer win. So as you can see from the table, we are in fourth. So we could actually qualify for, I guess, the Europa League, I'm pretty sure. So that's pretty cool. <laughs> so guys, hopefully you enjoyed the episode. Hopefully you're enjoying the series. Show your support. Let's get 15 likes on this video. All right? Anyways, guys, if you have any suggestions on things I can improve on the series, be sure to leave them down below. As well as if you have any suggestions for players I can buy in the January transfer window, be sure to leave that down below as well. Anyways, guys, if you liked the video, be sure to like it. And if you feel like it, go ahead and subscribe to my channel. I'll see you guys later. Peace!